Yeah, it's good evening, ladies and gentlemen. It's nice to be back in the parish where I used to live for several years. First of all, I'd like to uh, talk about uh, immigration, and we do need an immigration policy, and we haven't got one. Until we do have one, we're going to have this piecemeal situation of not knowing where we're going. Also, on the point of a few things that I've done in the past, I mean, I'm the found, one of the founders of the Jersey Rights Association, I've gone right the way through the uh, mill from committee member to honorary secretary to chairman and to deputy chairman. Also, I've taken part in uh, tribunals for Jacks, and I've won for my clients uh, compensation, which I think is, is very, very important indeed. On the front of what's going to happen to us in the future, I believe, first of all, uh, an, uh, a challenge was made last night at St. Saviour's about this, that who runs the island? Is it the council of ministers, or is it the chief officers that bully the council of ministers into making the decisions? Until we establish this, and this is a very, very interesting point, because I do agree with what some of the council ministers say. On the other hand, with the incident that happened about the 13,000 uh, airfare situation, which is disgusting, and a lot of the council ministers actually were against that, and they actually spoke out about it. The situation is that we have to get our house in order, and it's extremely, extremely important we do it as soon as we possibly can. Because if we don't, we're really going to know about this with the middle of Jersey, as my colleague has mentioned, and the other aspects of what's going to happen over here. I mean, this is a beautiful, beautiful island. I love this place very much indeed. And I don't want to see it go to rack and ruin by being overpopulated, which we can't control, to have things over here that could happen that I don't want to see happen. I've seen some very, very disgusting and horrible things in my life to do with terrorism when I was in Fleet Street. You don't want that here, and I don't want it here. So I want to see things and carry on the way they're carrying on for an establishment as far as the situation. We need to sort out several aspects, and the aspects of the population, uh, security, and other aspects as well. I think personally that this could be done, but it can't be done by me alone. It's got to be done by all of us, and we've got to sit down and talk about this together. If we don't, then things take night. There's a lot of things where people turn around and say it goes over their heads. And why does it go over their heads? Because they're not interested. We have to diversify on what we do on the economy here. I mentioned a couple of things last night, my ideas, that I want to put forward. So I'm going to close because the bell's going to ring. So vote Ocean on the 7th of September and keep the island afloat. Thank you very much.